Another aspect to this story is two HVAC maintenance workers caught in the gunfire. We heard that moments ago. James Lewis shot and killed. Another worker was shot and is in critical condition at the hospital. Both work for GSM services in Gastonia. WCNC Charlotte's Lana Harris is on the ground there with more. Lana. Good evening. Yeah, people here in Gastonia are shocked that two of their own members were targeted like this. This is right where they worked. Again, GSM services, and you can see they have here prayers please out front. The community is really pulling for Robert Shook, who is currently in the hospital fighting for his life, and of course, devastated for James Lewis, who was killed. And we visited Shook's family's home today, and they are, of course, horrified about this. They say he is a good man and a good father, and still something like this has happened to him. Shook's family members have reported he has been in surgery. At one point, they had to stop surgery because of blood loss, and they say it hasn't been looking good, so they are pulling for him to get through this, knowing that his coworker, James Lewis, did not get through this. We did talk to Lewis's father, who said James was his best friend and his only child. He said he was also a single father who went back to night school to make a better life for his own three kids and can't wrap his mind around the fact that his son was simply at the wrong place at the wrong time. Don't shoot the entire family and whoever else happened to be there. His beef was not with my son. He had never met my son. He never laid eyes on him. You can just hear that pain in his voice. It was hard to talk to him. He is absolutely devastated. And coming up, we'll hear more from him and more from neighbors who knew James Lewis. And again, Robert Shook's family is asking for the community for prayers. Here in Gastonia, I'm Lana Harris, WCNC Charlotte. Unimaginable pain for those families. Lana, thank you.